Okay, we're fighting another warlock, so let's go for the Lepernome value. We got the two drop. Okay, cool. These warlocks got a very slow start. So we're just going to take advantage of this by drawing. I'm probably going to switch it up here uh, pretty soon probably play this paladin deck because the paladin deck is going to be a lot more uh, interactive like it'll actually have like a clear game plan versus just hoping and praying that we draw in the right order we can at least like have a little bit more decision making but it still has you know a combo at the end of it which is really hard for me to say no to this guy's playing galakron and uh Galakron in wild is Galakron warlock even worth a damn I've seen people have success with like Galakron warrior and like an aggressive build but I don't know about Galakron warlock I still run normal mage decks yeah but I just don't want to play mage Mage is already really hard for us to beat, unless they're, like, really, really slow. I'm fine with playing Warlock, because most Warlocks have to play a late game. And that gives me, uh, that gives me capability to beat them. I just played Hand Buff all Wild Paladin to get gold one without a loss. Dude, get used to that. That deck is hard to lose with. You can fall upwards and suddenly just win. The biggest thing you have to play around is, like, Silence, though. Whenever you get to the higher ranks, be aware of that. But yeah, Hambuff, Hambuff Paladin and Wild is just the Tuber Nuts. Okay. Well, it's a very beefy board that you've made. Yes, I did say fall upwards. It's an expression, dude. It means you could climb with the deck even when misplaying horribly. <laughs> like, even if you're not doing the optimal plays, you can still win very, very, very easily with that deck. Like, I remember playing it once and thinking, my lord, this is so disgusting. I don't, I mean, I don't enjoy the gameplay of it, but I can understand why people can have fun with it. But you very easily can fall upwards and not play the deck optimally, but still win the game because of it. I'm just going to devolve. I don't want to waste a volcano here. <sighs> Fucking wolf, man. I guess I have to take a little bit of damage. This is one thing that, that I kind of mean about my deck. There's not a lot of uh, versatility. I'm very much at the mercy of what my opponent is there, is doing. And like this guy has a very aggressive strategy. Oh boy. Well now I have to volcano. Ah, damn it. Our sight. I guess I could just devolve again. Hope something better comes out of these. There we go. That's nice. That is very nice. I guess something else that we can do is uh, there's a little draw. Geppetto. Very nice. We'll hex this. Suddenly our opponent only has two playable minions. This seems uh, like a lot, uh, like a like a better uh, resolve here. He did have a grim rally though, 
but you know, he has one less in deck. Oh, this is beautiful. Oh, this is beautiful. This is exactly what I wanted, dude. This is how, this is how we punish. This is how we punish, bro. We got the shutter walk in hand. We haven't played Grumble yet, so we can't play Shutter Walk. We're pretty much waiting for the second Grim Rally or the uh, the other Invoke card. I mean, he can trade and replace two minions. Like you can, like one minion isn't going to be the end of the world. Oh wow, that's a seven one. That actually might be the end of the world. <laughs> I mean, I need to play minions, though. I can't just sit here and do nothing. You know what? Now is, now is a time, good time to switch. Screw it. Go for the kill. We'll play to Undertaker. Get the value out of the death rattles, and then we'll have him by the balls. Because he's at 9 HP. I mean, I, it's fine though, dude. Because now we're pressuring him. We, it, like, that turn did its job. If we can extend it, that's great. But, I mean, that, that's the thing about Hearthstone, you know? Like, you, you, some, you gotta be able to change your game plan every now and again. Like, now he's playing so behind. He's playing so behind, and now we just have a 6-5 Undertaker that can't be answered. And it's got seven damage inside of it. So if you kill it, you're gonna kill yourself. I could have played the Shutter Walk there as well, but I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna just let it sink in. <laughs> At the same time, the Shutter Walk could fail, which is another reason why we gotta wait. Oof. Oh, we hit the we hit the Grumble. Oh, we just, so we just win. Wait, what? Did I fuck this up? I fucked this up. <laughs> Shit, I fucked this up. Wait, at the same time, I could just kill him. No, I, I win. Yes! <laughs> Got him. Got him. Totally planned. <laughs> totally planned lethal. <laughs> totally planned. <laughs>